Action! Okay, I'm back again for all you friends in France. I'm going to explain to you about our master, Lamet, his toolbox, and uh, his square, and uh, how do you keep a square square, and what you should do if your square is not square. So, here in this drawer, we have what we call a framing square, and we also have what we call an engineer square. Now this one never leaves the toolbox. Why? We don't really know why. It just stays there, okay? We're never going to use it. This one we use around the shop. Why? Because it's never square. It's a framing square. It moves on its own. So, if this one is not square, we check with this one. Like so. It's not square. A little bit help. So, to square it up, we simply take this in two hands and we beat the fuck out of it on a cabinet <laughs> or a nearby metal object. Like, like these lights. These will work. Okay, now to check if it's square, we don't need that anymore. This is just stupid. We'll put that back in the toolbox. We just, uh, you know, simply look at it, look at it with our eye and all. Okay, it looks, looks square. It's got to be square. Hey, there's, there's other ways you can square it up. You can, uh, if you go down to the floor here, you can put one foot on it. You can fucking just ream on it like that and get a couple kicks and toss it across the shop. And uh, that should solve all your issues. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's about it. And uh, I'll be back with you another time to talk about the belt sander and how useful of a tool it is. It's, it's for everything, okay? Thanks, bye.